Hi, 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 welcome back. So, we are working on Ermigerd Vergers. Ermigerd Vergers. Ermigerd Vergers. Oh, we lost our sign. I'm going to put up a new sign. Oh, yeah, sorry. It was right where the it's wall okay. was supposed to go. Yeah. Future site of Ermigerd Vergers. Yes. Hashtag hype. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> so you're working on the floor. Ooh. I'm working on the floor design. I like what you. It looks like a basketball court. Oh, does it? Only a little. Like, it's not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. I should put like it's a. It's more of an observation. I should, I should put a. Uh, what do you call it? An item frame there with a water bucket in it. <laughs> really good idea for making a basket <laughs> have you been bill battling <laughs> i have not actually oh. there's I've a seen... zombie over on pork i think their employees are evil <laughs> well i think with that sludge coming out of there i think they've got a problem oh maybe an infestation those zombies could be coming right out of there like yeah if you I eat think their it's a breeding food ground. If you eat their food, you yeah, become a zombie. Right. Mm-hmm. This is why we need healthy alternatives. Yes. That are conscientious of your body and of the world. I think it's important to talk about your competition and understand what your mission statement is as a business. Right. So How are we different from them? We're different because... A, we have zero emissions, like no... No emissions. No emissions, no uh, harmful products exit this building. Right. Everything that comes in is natural, and mm -hmm. everything is consumed and used, and there is no waste. No whatsoever. waste at all. Even the wrappers that we place our burgers in are completely edible. Oh, that's such a good idea. Right? We can use, like, paper. Yeah. Paper's edible, edible right? I mean, it's sure. sugar cane. If which you is chew edible. it long enough. You just craft it a different way. Right. It's still sugar cane. It's made from the same stuff. Same stuff. So it's totally edible. Mm-hmm. Logic. Oh, I fell. <laughs> so great. We so we have the wrappers. Mm-hmm. And we won't, we like, use ink and stuff on them. That way they're, like, super safe. Right. We don't pollute. We don't pollute. We're healthy for the environment. Right. Um, so we, healthy. Uh, we don't harm the animals. Right, because I mean, it's vegetarian. There are no right. animals being harmed in the making of this burger. We need to have no, that as meat. a disclaimer somewhere. Yes. Kind of like what they do with movies, but mm -hmm. with burgers. No bovines were hurt in the making of these delicious burgers. Yes. Now, do you think we need to do like a, uh, what's it, what's it called? Like a consumer study where we do like a blind control mm. test to make sure. I mean, we haven't really talked about like a recipe. I mean, we talked a little bit about a recipe, but making sure that people like the taste and stuff. Right. Or should we just dive in and hope that the world likes it? I mean... It's not like we're making something brand new here. It's true. It's so an old idea like, that we're just bringing back to life. Right. I don't think it's totally necessary for us to be absolutely sure that people like our burgers. Yeah. I think it's kind of a given. I mean, I guess that's the whole idea. Most people who will buy this won't care as much how it eats because it's be they're getting it because they feel good about better Yeah, about it's not about it, the right? burger. It's about how you feel when you eat the burger. Right. Which about is the burger, good. burger, places like McDonald's wouldn't exist. Right. Right. Because it's about feeling, well, except you don't feel conscientious when you eat McDonald's necessarily, but <laughs> I know what you mean, though. It's the same idea. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Same idea, <laughs> different way. <wave. laughs> oh, whoops. I fell again. I fall a lot when I'm building. So where where is pork over here has kind of left it open as to what exactly is in their product? Yeah, I mean if they're not using actual pork, what is it? That's right. the question. 
Right. Um, what are they serving you? We're being very straightforward. Yeah, we are. I think so like, honesty is going to be crucial to our business, mm-hmm. to having that sort of consumer and business trust where they know what they're getting. Yep. Yeah. I mean, we're going to have our ingredients outside of our restaurant, right? Right. Like, they'll just see it right there. Mm-hmm. So All the ingredients sense. that go into making these. Like, this is the stuff that's going into this burger that's going into your body. Mm-hmm. And you are going to feel so happy because you know you're doing the right thing. Yep. Even if it doesn't taste good. <laughs> <laughs> Which it, it will taste Which it'll fine. Which it'll taste fine. It's going to be... It'll taste fine. It's going to be decent. I've eaten plenty of veggie burgers in my day. I have not, but I'm imagining that they are good. Can I confess something to you? Yes. I've never had a veggie burger. (laughs) Ever. (laughs) You've never had like a portobello? Okay, I've had like, I have like portobello grills and stuff. I do that. But I've never had like... A veg, something that's called a veggie burger. I don't know why. Like, I always see it on the menu and I'm like, ooh, I should try that. And then I always go, or I'll get the real deal. And then I get the real deal. (laughs) (laughs) And I feel a little bit of guilt, but mostly I'm really happy. (laughs) Yeah. And like, okay. So this is one of those things where I gotta, if I'm gonna support this cause, I need to start, you know, doing my part, right? Well, you know, it's it's up to you. I, I would never <laughs> force somebody. <laughs> force someone to eat our food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're not animals. We're not animals. We don't want to force people to do anything. Right. Or force animals to do anything. Right. That's the whole point. We're not, we are all about passive. We're all about consent. (laughs) 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 Um, Let's not make that our motto, though. Um, Yeah, I think this is good. I think we're having good, a good direction. The only thing that is still somewhat of a concern to me is that we will not have any help. So, I mean, you're the CEO. Right. Oh, yeah. Like, who's actually going to run it? Mm Mm-hmm. I didn't really think about that. Well, I know a couple people. You do? I do. Are uh, any of them, like, employee material? Like... Uh, I mean, they work, they, they don't expect much as far as pay. Well, that's always a plus. Right. The more we can lower other people's, like, needs, the better. Yeah. I mean, cost-wise, it's going to be a good deal for us. Right. Um, I mean, we're not doing this for profit. We're doing it for the betterment of the server. Mm-hmm. But if we can make some profit that's right really good to be able to pour back into the community mm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yes so it's that sounds important. like a very noble thing that it's, you've come up with it's important that we make sure we are being responsible with our resources and yes having a fair price yeah um so you may you may remember uh, when I did my first mindless mining episode. Oh yeah yeah yeah! I think I remember. Wasn't I there for that? You were there for that. In um, spirit, I don't I don't spirit, remember it very well. The part of Anasia was played by um, Armor Stand Number One. Oh, okay, Armor Stand. They did so good. <laughs> they did great, right? They are very good. They at like pretending nailed to know what they're it. Doing. They nailed yes. it. Because every time throughout that whole thing. Every time you would look to the armor stand for my response, like they got it every time, yep. my actual response. They knew it what was, was going on. So it was I figured really we, impressive. I can call one of them up and say, hey, listen, we've got this business venture. It's going to pay little to nothing, probably mm-hmm. nothing, 
but would you be interested? Oh, that's that's a good idea. I think they're going to go for it. Awesome. That would be so great. You know what else we need? We have an employee. What? So, okay, we have a business plan. Right. We have an employee. Right. We have no place to do business. Oh, you are so right. Like, where are we going to have meetings and stuff? We can't, like, do it here in the restaurant. That would be kind of awkward to do in front of, like... You can't talk about customers while they're there. That's true. So that's We need a place to gossip about the customers. (laughs) We need a place to, like, talk. (laughs) What about Oink? Oh, well, okay. If we're not having to really pay our employees, Mm -hmm. we could use that money to rent a space over at Oink. If they have some available. I think I did this one too low. I did. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I think that would work really well. Well, maybe I can inquire with... uh, With Oink. With Oink. I'm not even sure who runs that. I think it's Dave. Is it Dave? I thought it was Jake and Maybe it's Jake. I don't even... I don't even know. I'm going to run over there real quick and see if there's a name anywhere. We we can inquire, see if we can get an office space that we we will have a spot to compute our Mm -hmm. funds, finances, have meetings. Oink offices. Eventually, we may need to, like, invest in something like a, uh, like a business, uh, yacht or something you know to be able Mm. to effectively tell others about our business so we can travel to other places in our yacht and let them know how good our burgers are i think that's important you know maybe we should prioritize that because even if we don't make a lot of money right off like, if we look like we're making money, people will think that our burgers are really good. Does that make sense? Oh, my gosh. I've never heard a more truer statement in my life. Yeah. Like, we fake it till you make it. But so if when we you make look it, fancy, people will think we're actually fancy. So they'll yeah. come eat our burgers. And then they'll be loyal customers forever. Yep. Man, did you go? Did you go to business school? Uh, no, but I had some friends who were business majors back in college. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> so maybe that counts. <laughs> My mom worked as like a secretary for the business department at the university that I worked at. That makes sense. Yeah. So maybe it's from her. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> so legit. Wow. I know. I didn't even realize I was that legit. Man. All this um, time, I thought I was just an art major. I think this is Poets because his office has a piece of paper in a chest that says legit ownership documents. Okay. That sounds very poety. And he has lots of books. So I think that's, I think he's the owner. So maybe okay. we talk to him. That's a good idea. I also found a secret office that said Jake's office, and it led me to like an underground lair. What? That I don't think I was supposed to see. <laughs> oh my goodness. They've got some stuff going on there, huh? Yeah. It's Maybe very we can, place. you know, study them a little bit so we can understand. Maybe we can learn something from them. From their it's a possibility. Business practices. They do seem pretty knowledgeable about how to run a business. Yeah, I mean, they seem to be... It's the same idea. Maybe they're faking it, but they look like they're successful, so... And it worked on us. It worked on us. They got our business. It did. Yeah, they did. Or they will. Oh, this looks great. Hopefully. I'm actually going to change this floor design okay. so that it fits with your layout. Oh, okay. Sounds good. Sorry, I apologize. I should have... No. Showing you what I was doing. I was hasty. I was hasty in my build. My ideas. I'm going to go ahead and put down some more sea lanterns. That way we get light. Mm, good idea. Light it up, up, up. I'm a fire! (laughs) Whoa! (laughs) Ooh, what Uh if we have, like, 
music here from time to time. Oh, that's good. We could we could do some things. I think I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna move some of these furnaces. Even though they cooked cactus, I figure they'll probably still be really usable. Yeah. For food too. Yeah, it's fine. There we go. Perfect. You feeling good about this? I'm feeling so good about this. This looks so good. Oh, so look good. Word. <laughs> <laughs> Can't pass up an opportunity. I love that you do that, though, because usually it's like <laughs> just me. <laughs> and, you know, you get the looks. Yeah. Like, okay. The looks. We're not in middle school anymore, okay? And I'm like, so hey, it's a classic. Dang kids, don't know. Dang kids. Boop. Oh, Maybe we should have like a basement or something. Mm, that's a good idea. I'm gonna do some stuff with the leaves. Okay. Since we're a very green thing, I think maybe incorporating that into our build style. It's a good call. Will encourage people to trust us. It's really about just building trust that is, it doesn't have to be based on anything. It doesn't have to be. Right. It doesn't have to be like sound. earned or something. No. We don't have time for that. No. We need them to just have like instantaneous trust in us. Yes. Mm hmm. I think that's healthy. I got an idea. In this case. Because it's us. How about, uh, as the British say, some some ropes for the queue. Ooh. Right here. Ro leading Ooh, up to the... Ooh, perfect! Yeah. So good! So good! Okay, I'm putting in some little lighty bits here. This upstairs is looking pretty nice, too. Yeah, let me check it out. Maybe we could have like a VIP eatery area. Ooh, yeah. Like maybe you ran out for parties. Oh, that's a good idea. <gasps> that's perfect. More money. More money. I mean, opportunities yeah, for people opportunities. to use our services. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. this is so nice. You walk up. You, the, yeah. You tell the customers where they need to go. Mm -hmm. what they want to eat and they'll just do it and then maybe we we can do like yeah, yeah, yeah. menu coming soon all beef veggie patties right that way people who are vegetarian will be happy and people who aren't vegetarian will be happy and everyone will be happy you will love, love it. <laughs> or else. Or else. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Cool. Cool. I think this looks pretty good. All we gotta do looks now really is good. have tables and seating mm -hmm. and probably a sign on top. Yeah, we I was need thinking, signage. what if we do? You know how some of those places have like a giant like thing of the food that you're selling. Mm -hmm. We could do like a giant burger. Yeah. That way, people know. This is where you get burgers. Yeah. It needs to be taller than pork over here. Uh, yeah, pork is really tall, but we need to at least be like comparable. Can we move this tree? This tree is like blocking our. It is. Yeah. You can't Once even we... see our shop. Once we landscape, get this looking yeah, all right. This is gonna be so good. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't not do it. Uh, I don't have anything to pillar up other than wood. That's redundant. <laughs> Chop down the wood so I can pillar up and. Yeah. Chop down more wood. Okay, let me get rid of this tree so we can get a good look at our business we should probably like block the door or something 
Maybe people aren't snooping around. Mm, mm-hmm. Do you want me to make an iron door? Ooh, that's a good idea. Do you have the iron for that? Oh, I got the iron for it. Man. I always carry iron with me. You're so prepared. Urn. Yep. Ooh, we can have like a side sides to go with the burgers, like apples and carrots and mm, veggies mm -hmm. and fruits. It's a great idea. More vegetables with your veggie burger. I like it. Urgh. Okay, that should go there. Take that, Zomble. It's perfect. These zombie problems are really concerning. I think we might have to... May need to take legal action if this pork thing is actually hosting mm -hmm. this. Because that might In scare indubitably. off Indubitably. Our... Indubitably. I'm not Who shooting. I'm me? not shooting at you, by the way. I'm shooting at the. I thought a skeleton was shooting at me or something. <laughs> no, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> Never fear. <laughs> I just have bad aim. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Dang it! I didn't do. I oh, this looks first. so good. There's a witch on top of our. Of course, there is. Thing. Stupid witch. I guess we'll need she to like do that. Do some something with lighting up there. Oh, get off it. Leave me alone. That looks so good, though. Yes. Our little burger joint. Question. Yeah. Should the door be over here? Or should it be, like, here? Um. Like, I didn't do it here because of the pond. But if the pond is right. gone. It almost would... I kind of feel like that would really well, make like, more sense, maybe? Like right here, maybe? Ooh, yeah, kind of off-center. Yeah, maybe we adjust it to have like a Can little bit of an right awning here. here. That way it's partially centered. Mm-hmm. Centered on the half shell mm -hmm. turtle power. <laughs> <laughs> exactly my thoughts. <laughs> I thought so. Okay, yeah, I think this will be a good adjustment. Uh, Winders. Winders! Winders? Winders! Okay. I was playing Lotro the other night with my sisters, uh -huh. or my sister and her husband and stuff, and uh, someone in the, like, world chat was talking named winter spelled just like winter on our server. Oh really? And I was like, oh, winter please! <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't her, but I got really excited there for a second because yeah, I think this is a good, yeah, that makes so much sense. Also, there's much a better. creeper on top. You would. You would. Wow. That was a good shot. Thanks. Bow skills. Bow skills. I think we made some good progress today. Mm-hmm. I agree. This what do you think of the pond? Oh, did you just get I rid like of these? I like the pond. I don't know what I did. I don't remember. That's fine. Oh. Hi. That was stupid of me. <laughs> this is going to be easier. <laughs> than doing that. Okay. Going to dump the stuff that I don't need. Perfect. We did so good. Yes. Teamwork. High five. I'm gonna make it. I'm, uh, high five. Uh, Out. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make another chest. Okay, sounds good. Because I still have lots of stuff in my inventory. Oh man. My inventory. We need to have like a groundbreaking ceremony and everything. Oh, I guess we already passed the groundbreaking. <laughs> but like an opening day. Yes. Definitely. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what did I s say before? Future site of Ermigard Burgers. Uh, notice. I think that's what I said. Notice me, senpai. <laughs> right. Can I get a picture of you in front of it? Yes. I'll stand in front of that. It looks so Smile. good. Oh my goodness. Smell real pretty. <gasps> 
Oh, so good. It was perfect. <laughs> I love the head tilt. Okay, my turn. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's so happy. There you go. That was good. Thanks. Good job. Tune thank in. you for letting me be a part of your dream. Yes, thank you for being part of my dream. Tune in <laughs> next time, folks, as we continue our progress with Here We Good Burgers. I'm a good burger. I'm a good burger. Word. 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 <laughs> we need a third. We need our yeah. employee to be like, yeah. word. <laughs> the third one. The third word. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll okay, see bye. you next time. Okay, bye. 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 Bye